What went wrong? A hotel was supposed to go inside the old Kaufman's building, but three years later, it still hasn't happened. Channel 11's Aaron Clark is live after finding out why the hotel is putting the blame on the developer. Well, Peggy, according to court documents, the hotel operator says that it was ready to open up this hotel 18 months ago, but it claims that the developer repeatedly delayed construction with no end in sight. It wasn't unusual for folks to say, meet me at the clock on this once busy corner where Kaufman's department store and later Macy's stood before they closed and left the building vacant. Four years ago, construction started on a project that would breathe new life into the building with a hotel, luxury apartments and retail. But a year and a half after the expected opening date, the doors of the even hotel are still closed. Are they ever going to be finished? That's the same question the group behind the hotel is asking. It's now suing the developer Core Realty of Philadelphia for at least $15 million. The hotel group says it has suffered massive monetary damages as a result of Core's extreme delay in completing its construction. They need to put something down here to make money. The suit claims that repeated delays have made it impossible to open the 160 room hotel and cause the hotel operator to lose millions it would have earned if the hotel opened in 2017. Pittsburgh residents who remember downtown in its heyday say seeing the landmark building standing vacant is devastating. See, that makes no sense. And they hope something changes soon. Well, Becky, I reached out to Core Realty and tried to get in contact with someone from the hotel. I haven't heard back yet, but if we do, we will let you know. Reporting live tonight from downtown, Erin Clark, Channel 11 News.